Hello, welcome in to Test Beer Bomb 420 Liquor Review. We have a liquor here that we have about a shot or a shot's worth, because what we did was we put a little bit of that amount in with a little bit of some root beer, because we're going to see what it's like at the end with root beer. And you're going to see a shot glass that isn't filled all the way with the product. But I'm going to do that amount back. And, I'm gonna, and when I do it from the shot glass, it's completely 100% warm to get all the flavors. Um, the pop is going to probably make the amount in the pop cold. So the hard liquor we're looking at today, folks, is the original Sailor Jerry Spiced Rum, 92 proof, 46% alcohol. So it's a Caribbean rum with spice, caramel, and other natural flavors. It's bold and smooth. The back talks a bit about uh, Sailor Jerry with the old school tattoos and all that. But with the rum here, it says it's blended with the finest rums from the Caribbean and our unmatched recipe of natural spices. Ed, the old school way, 92 proof, bold, bold and smooth as hell. Sailor Jerry Rum, product of the United States of America. Drink responsibly, bottled by Sailor Jerry Rum, Edison, New Jersey. Oh, okay. And on the back of the label, there's a different drawing of that girl. It's going to be hard to see, but you can kind of tell, right? So anyways, we got a little bit. Um, when I was open, when I opened it to pour it, I didn't even smell it from the bottle yet. And it's like, oh, I can notice that a bit. So let's see with the amount in the bottle. Oh, wow. Alcohol, vanilla, caramel. Wow. I'm smelling like lots of caramel, vanilla, and like alcohol kind of smells. Out of the bottle. I don't know if I'm getting like the spice and stuff from the shot glass. I'm going to say from the shot glass, it's a lot more caramel. I don't even know if I get any what I thought was vanilla from the bottle. That part's not there as strongly. And actually, out of the shot glass, seems to have like a little bit of like a herbal grassy note with it. But wow, it really smells alcoholic and stuff. I thought I got some vanilla out of the bottle with the caramel. Out of the shot glass, I thought I just got caramel and like some grassy herbal notes, but you always get the alcohol, and let's give it a whirl. Huh. It's got that warming burn for your throat. Oh, it's starting to warm up in the belly. It's got a lot of burn. Alcohol stringy at 46%. Jeez. Burn, burn, burn. The whole stomach's now just fucking on fire like the pic video at the bottom there. Whoa. Whoo! That's a lot of warmth in the belly. If you're cold, that will warm you up, so to speak. So the alcohol is starting to seem warm for the most part. Like the belly's all burning. But anyways, um, and in the throat too. It's got that hardcore alcohol taste. It's got a typical kind of like rum taste. It's a little sweet. For all the burn it has at 46%, it's got a hell of a burn, and yeah, that is pretty smooth, I guess you could say. Flavor-wise, your typical spiced rum, like a typical rum flavors, kind of a little like citrusy sweet, a bit of like a caramel taste, a little sticky kind of the liquid itself. And it just kind of smooths out with the caramel and citrus. As it burns you, oof, still some warmth, but it's a little squeeze on the throat, and it's not as warm in the belly anymore. And then just uh, with the rest of that shot, mixed with a little bit of root of beer, and smell-wise, um, mostly just smelling the root beer, because there's probably more root beer in here than the rum, but... It's got a little bit of like a spice note, and you can smell a little bit of the alcohol. So with root beer, Sailor Jerry. <coughs> um, near 
near the end of the drink, with all that root beer taste, there was a little caramel taste hint. And then, just before the final root beer taste, a little bite or something from the rum. But, you basically lose all that burn and everything. So, to re-sum it up quickly, I smoked caramel and what I thought was vanilla from the bottle. From the shot glass, I was getting like caramel and almost like a grassy herbal note taste. Um, on its own, I could taste the stickiness, some caramel, some like typical rum flavors, you know, all that stuff. And all the different ways that you felt the 46% burn and warm you up through the belly and throat. And then mix with the root beer, you lose the majority of the burn, like none of it's in the throat. There's just a little in the stomach. And in that root beer, depending on how much you use, it seems that there's a moment of caramel with the root beer. And then a little weird bite at the end. So, yeah. Hope I've reviewed it well enough. And that's it. Sailor Jerry.